Nothing will ever prepare you for what you find when you're cleaning out your garage. And I am telling you now, not only did I shit myself with all the spiders in here, I really genuinely thought that I'd killed another living being. But this garage needed doing, to be fair. It is like something out of a hoarder's house. I'm not even attempting the rafters today because they have a similar amount of junk up there, which is like ten times heavier and I just can't be dealing. Not only did I pull a muscle in my bum cheek, I also twisted my ankle. And that's why time lapses are amazing because you can't even tell that it happened. Also, I don't know what it is about me and my mum. My mum has rugs she doesn't want anymore, but she doesn't want to throw them out. So she gives them to me and then I put them in my house for a bit and then they get grubby. Then I attempt to clean them. They never come clean and then they start to smell. So they end up in the garage. So they had to go. They were crusty, they were dusty and they were gross. So this video is just a case of moving things from one side, cleaning that, to the other side, cleaning that, then organising it and putting it back. And I'm so proud of myself. I've had stuff in here since we moved in and never used them. They're going. They're being rehomed or going to the tip. So this is the bit we have to look closely. Bottom left corner. Can't even believe I caught this on camera. And here comes the actual footage. What even is that? I need to save it, whatever it is. Like, are you going to kill me or... Whoa, you've gone frozen. Oh my goodness. <gasps> oh, shit. He's fine, he's fine. I'm just going to go wash him. So I did, in fact, wash him, give him water and give him a bite to eat. And then I put him back out into the wilderness. I really wanted to keep him. But anyway, look at the transformation. I can't even. It's perfect.